Police in Nyahururu have impounded 57 crates of illicit brew that were being transported from Nakuru to Nyahururu. Meanwhile, security officers in Makueni County have arrested two people involved to be behind the vandalism of government infrastructure and selling them to scrap metal dealers. 57 crates of illicit brew have been impounded by authorities along the Nakuru Nyaururu Highway. Nyaururu Deputy County Commissioner Muteki Ndambuki said that the vehicle ferrying the illicit brew was intercepted by police during their normal routine checks where they arrested one female suspect. Na wakati officers wa DCI wameisimamisha normal routine check. Baka kutanda nizi crates ambazo ni suspicious. Alafu tukaweza kushika. Na we suspect hii ni pombe aramu. Nafikiria wakati umeona ikimwagwa chini hapa hakuna povu inatoka na hii ni pombe ambayo inaweza kuwa hatari kwa wananchi. Ndambuki caution those engaging in illegal activities in the county will catch up with the law. Hizi wazaona ukiona hapa hizi ni kileta uh, 57 na um, already we have uh, through the office ya DCO tumeita maofisa wa KRA wakuja waangalie angalia kama ni sumu na tunaamini ni sumu kwa sababu vile packaging yake hata chupa unaangalia ni chupa chafu na hii chupa na hii pombe tunaamini kwamba inaweza kuleta madhara kwa wananchi meanwhile two people have been arrested in Makweni county for being involved in vandalism Makweni sub county police commander Winnie Siele decided to conduct a search after receiving complaints from the public over increased cases of metal theft especially from public infrastructures the two are also involved in the theft of street lights and water pipes Lewa asubui, tuliweza eh, kufanya eh, operation hapa maketi yetu ya wote na tuliweza kupata baadhi ya zile vitu ilikuwa imeripotiwa ambaye kuna zingine tumetipitisha kulingana na ile report tulikuwa tumeletewa na tumeweza kutipitisha ni zile vitu ilikuwa imeripotiwa kupotea elsewhere a woman's suspect is in custody for allegedly extorting money from unsuspecting members of the public. Mayor Narendra Takrar is accused of obtaining 600,000 shillings from businessman Arbaz Kureshi. The suspect is also accused of siphoning more than 30 million shillings from various unsuspecting victims. She was arraigned at Kibera Law Courts where she was remanded for seven days pending the conclusion of investigations. No, this case is almost one to two, one to one and a half years and the lady has been roaming freely. We have, we have reported and uh, now we are happy that you know she's been brought to court and uh, you know justice is, uh, justice is given because this lady has conned very many people. There are several cases everywhere. There is also people in Nakuru everywhere. She has gone too many people, so she need, these type of things are what we need to start moving on very quickly and act faster.